everyone. I am Ms. Tamalanchali, Assistant Professor, Department of Nutrition and Dietetics from KSR Arts and Science College for Women, Trishankodu. In this video, we are going to discuss about the important topics of public health nutrition, which are national policies for malnutrition, importance of first thousand days, and global health target 2025, communicable diseases and its epidemiology, and immunization schedule. First, national policies for malnutrition. These programs implemented are by direct nutrition. What are the direct nutrition programs? Ministry of Health and Family Welfare have implemented National Vitamin A Prophylaxis Program, National Nutritional Anemia Prophylaxis Program for Mother and Children, National Goiter Control Program, and Ministry of Human Resource Development have implemented ICDS Scheme, which is Integrated Child Development Scheme, Special Nutrition Program, Balwadi Feeding Program, and Midday Meal Program, which is successfully running in Tamil Nadu. Then Ministry of Food and Civil Supplies have implemented Nutrition Education and Extension Food Fortification Program. Then indirect nutrition programs are Ministry of Health and Family Welfare have implemented Primary Health Care Services, Immunization Programs and Family Welfare Programs. Then Ministry of Food and Civil Supplies have implemented Storage of Food Grains and General Warehousing, Public Food Distribution System. These are the national policies implemented for malnutrition. Then importance of first thousand days. What is in first thousand days? That is from conception, that is pregnancy to two years of age. The first thousand days are a period of rapid physical growth and accelerated mental development, which offers a unit or unique opportunity to build lifelong health of a children and their intelligence. The first thousand days refers to the period that is that begins with the pregnancy planning and it goes up with the child when uh, her second birthday reaches. Then each of this journey is special which influences uh, the mother and the children's development, growth and learning not only just now but also for her entire life. This is the importance of first thousand days. Then Global Health Target 2025, the main aim of Global Health Target 2025 is to improve maternal, infant and young child's nutrition. Uh, WHO member states have endorsed or implemented this Global Health Target uh, for improving maternal, infant and young child nutrition and they are also committed for their monitoring progress too. These targets are vital for identifying priority areas for action and also catalyzing global change. Uh, the main targets are achieve a 40% reduction in the number of children under 5 years old who was stunted and achieve a 50 percentage reduction of anemia in women who are under reproductive age, then achieve a 30 percentage reduction in low birth weight, then ensure that there is no increase in childhood overweight, that is we have to decrease the childhood overweight and obesity, then increase the rate of exclusive breastfeeding up to first six months at least 50 percentage, then reduce and maintain childhood wasting to less than 5%. These are the global health targets which need to be achieved by 2025. Then communicable diseases and its epidemiology. First, what is communicable diseases? Communicable diseases includes HIV, AIDS, tuberculosis, malaria, viral hepatitis, sexually transmitted infections and neglected tropical diseases which are the leading cause of death and disability in low income countries and also in marginalized population. Uh, these are the main causes of death. So communicable diseases are the leading causes of death in worldwide uh, and its epidemiology are HIV is a still major global health public issue have affected 36.3 million lives so far. Then 1.5 million people are died from TB every year and it makes the world's second top infectious killer disease after COVID-19. Then children aged under 5 years accounted for 77% of all malarial death worldwide in 2020. That is until 2020, 77% of under 5 age children are died due to malaria. So how to prevent this communicable disease? The one way is immunization. That, that is an immunization schedule uh, which is universal, universal immunization schedule in India. That is age, vaccine, the route of administrations are primary vaccination at birth, BCG. That is for tuberculosis, 
which can be uh, intradermal administration then opv that is oral polio vaccine zero dose that can be administered orally then at six week opv first dose and dpt first dose dpt is diphtheria petraeus tetanus vaccine which can be given by intramuscular then at 10th week opv second dose and dpt second dose and 14th week opv third dose and dpt third dose and then in 9 to 12 months measles vaccine which can be given by subcutaneous administration these are the immunization schedule for india to prevent the communicable diseases thank you